Grief is filling the homes of one Mid-Island community tonight as it comes to grips with losing two young brothers in a tragic accidental fire. Counselors and spiritual healers have descended on the Nanus First Nation north of Nanaimo to help because, as Sky Ryan reports, the impact is being widely felt through the area. People spill into the streets of the Nanus First Nation after a crisis meeting with grief counselors. It's just, it's very difficult. Um, there's a spiritual healer in right now from Up Island, and he's helping the community deal with some of the spiritual things that need to be done. Because they are facing an unprecedented tragedy in this small community north of Nanaimo. Two young lives gone at once. Brothers, seven year old Devin and nine year old Jordan Drake killed in this Wednesday house fire. Unable to escape the flames that are suspected to have started by candles lit in a power outage at their auntie and uncle's home. The grief that the community is going through, it's really heavy on the heart. That pain is being felt all around this Mid Island community. We're really uh, concerned with how the everybody here is, so we just thought we'd drop some money off. And down the road in Lanceville at the local market. I know, isn't that sad? The tragedy is dominating talk at the till, and manager Dean Pirazzoni feels he has to do something to help. It was absolutely tragic. We're all sick to our stomachs in this community. So the market is collecting donations. We're going to try and do a cash donations. We'll set up a table at the front and to help the family whose home burned to the ground and the family who has lost their children get the help they need. Imagine being a parent and losing two children. I mean, you, you see them that night and then the next day they're gone. Like, I mean, it's, it's tragic. I could not imagine anything worse than that. And it goes beyond just helping the community. The children that were lost were well known in this store. Like any little child, they go to the candy rack and, you know, they'd be helping their mummy and whatnot, so... Um, but very, very nice children. The Nanus Band is collecting donations and has set up trust funds for the impacted families as well. It's, it's humbling because we're getting um, calls from local organizations that we don't normally connect with and it's, uh, it's just really good to know that they have us in their minds right at this time. Meantime, demolition crews went to work on the home the boys died in, tearing it to the ground quickly Thursday. Their efforts removing at least the visual reminder of the tragedy that's unfolded here.